Okay, so I just downloaded Windows 11 and I had to enable TPM 2.0. I don't I didn't even know what that was, but it's some security thing you had to enable in the BIOS to download it. So I enabled that. I downloaded it. Every everything's fine. You can see everything's working, everything all right until you open Valorant. All right, see it's going to open normally and everything. It's going to do this. Now let me change the display thing real quick. Oh, here it is. The build Vanguard required TPM version 2.0 and I already have that enabled and secure boot to enable. So, okay, so you need the secure boot. You need to enable secure boot. And apparently this is the only game I need that enabled for. So we're going to, we're going to click on, let's do German chest. It loads up fast. And then look, oh wait, yeah, look, it works. The boot thing doesn't pop up. Ooh, all right, oh, all right. See, it didn't pop up for that, but I had that open for a little while. But we're gonna try this other games just to make sure. And we're gonna, we're gonna try Plants vs. Zombies. I forgot to sign in the EA and stuff. All right, hold on. We're just gonna try something else. Oh, let, let's try Doom. Let's try Doom. All right, so far, that's happened, but I'm gonna leave this open. Play for like five minutes just to make sure. So I had this open for about a while. Nothing popped up. But uh, we're gonna try one more game just, just to see. Everything's fine so far. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have this open for about three minutes. All right, so I had this open. I had this open for about a while. Still nothing. The problem is when I, I go to my BIOS, I, I turn on secure boot, then then I just get, then I exit it, save and exit, then I just get a blank screen, and then and then I restart it. I, I waited about five minutes. So five minutes is the longest I've waited, about five minutes. So I wait, I restart my PC, same thing. I restarted about three times before I went back to the BIOS, turned it off. And then when I turned it off and saved and exit, it loads up normally. Uh, so I don't, it's something with secure boot. I, mean, I, I, don't, I don't understand what the problem is. Here, I'll show, I'll show you what happens. Okay, so look, I go to BIOS. Because again, in order for me to play Valorant, I have to enable secure boot so this is what i did and i went to settings i went to events os and i had to make sure this was on uefi according to videos i watched to turn this on and then at first this was on setup mode or the system mode was on setup instead of user so I had to go to standard, then I had to go to custom, then I had to go back to standard. And then it said this, install the factory defaults. And then I press yes. This is what I did the first time to turn this on in the first place. And then enable, obviously, because this is what you need on in order to play Valorant for Windows 11, it seems, I guess. All right, then I press X. Secure boot. That's the only change I made. I, I disabled it. I mean, I enabled it. Disabled, enabled, save. Yes. Now, here's the problem. I'm just going to be on the blank screen. Yep. This is, look, look, this is what happened. I'm just on the blank screen. I waited for about five minutes. The same thing. Okay, turn off. Now turn it back on. Let's see what happens. Mm, it's 
same thing. And and then the first time I did this, I, I, I turned my PC off and on like three times and still blank screen. So, and then look, then look what happens when I go into BIOS and turn it off. So, I gotta restart my PC, turn it off and turn it back on again. Then the BIOS thing pops up for a short amount of time. So I press delete, then going back into it, go to setting, advanced, Windows OS, secure boot, and I turn it off. So I, so I turned it off. X, so disable, yes. And then watch, it, it loads up normally. So it, it's obviously a problem with that, I guess. I, I just don't know why it's doing that. So I can't play Valorant until I'm able to boot it with that on, with secure boot on. So it's load. You see the loading symbol now. And back to Windows. So see, look, I don't understand what it is with that. Boom, everything's back normal. I, I don't, but I just can't play Valorant because I need secure boot on, but I can't turn that on because I get a black screen every time I save and exit when I turn it on. So I don't under, I don't know what the problem is. And Valorant is the only game that does this on for some reason. Or well, from what I've tried, I've tried like three other games that, and it didn't have the problem. I haven't tried every game, but so far Valorant is the only problem with this, so I don't know.